my name is Bika, Bika Rebek, and um, I was actually born here in Ljubljana, um, but I've lived most of my life abroad. So I've been based in New York, in New York City for the past six years. Um, but before that, I lived in Vienna for a long time and I studied in Vienna. My project is called The Invisible Blanket. Um, and it's basically, um, it was, you know, a very direct proposal saying architecture of the, the architecture of the future is something ephemeral and changing and very light, um, maybe translucent. It's sort of, you know, in, in juxtaposition or opposition to something heavy and permanent. It is an installation that we did, um, and it's on a rooftop in New York. Um, and the idea was, um, it's made out of emergency blankets, you know, those blankets that you wrap yourself into when you're really cold. So on one side they're silver, on the, on the other side they're gold. So the silver side was on top, and when you look at that blanket from the top, you don't. it looks like a silver roof, because all the roofs in New York are painted silver. So, um, you know, it sort of disappears from satellite images and it disappears from above. Um, but underneath, it, it created this very low area that was, you know, maybe about this high, where people could uh, meet and it became this kind of little interaction zone. And I took this project just as an as a statement, kind of as an example of an extreme version where something is as thin, you know, as a, the thinnest possible surface, it's almost immaterial, but it creates an architecture, it creates, it creates an architectural space. I mean, I thought a lot about, a lot about this idea of future architecture because I think in a way it is a, um, it's a strange request because all architecture is about future, right? Because we're proposing um, something that is going to build, be built at some point in the future. Um, so in the beginning I thought actually the question doesn't make sense. <laughs> you know, but, I, but uh, now being here and seeing the range of speculative projects, I think, um, I think it's a valid question, but you can actually question that question itself as well.